Today, we're going to demonstrate how to put together the sieve stack for the Gilson GA6 Gilsonic Auto Siver Sonic Sifter, which offers precise and dependable particle separations of fine granular materials and dry powders. To begin, select desired sieves for testing. The capacity of the sieve stack assembly is seven standard sieves or three precision sieves. When using fewer sieves, spacers must be added to maintain the correct height for proper operation. Next, place the fines collector into the fines collector holder. The top ring of the collector should nest in the recess of the top ring of the holder. Attach the fines collector bottom to the fines collector holder by inserting the keyhole slot of the fines collector disc through the screw head of the holder. Now nest the stack of sieves to be used, finest at the bottom, coarsest at the top, with spacers as necessary to maintain the correct stack height, and place the sieve stack on top of the fines collector. Next, carefully deposit the sample onto the top sieve. Note that excessive loads on sieve cloth may result in damage to the sieve mesh. For proper separations, there should be no more than a thin layer of sample on any one sieve when the test is complete. If your material has especially high or low bulk density, please consult your Gilson Technical Support representative on your testing application. Now, insert the small end of the top cone onto the top sieve and place the diaphragm on the top cone with the metal ring facing down. Next, place the column lock over the diaphragm and press down until the stack locking bars snap onto the top ring of the fines collector holder. Now, insert the sieve stack assembly into the sieving chamber until it rests against the stops on the platform. Stacking the sieves with the labels facing to the side will allow unobstructed viewing of the materials during sieving operations. Release the sieve stack locking bars by inserting the thumb and forefinger inside the bars at the bottom of the stack and forcing them outward. When the locking bars are released, the stack assembly will rise upward and the top of the column lock should fit into the stack locking ring located at the top of the sieving chamber, and thereby securing the sieve stack in place. Check that the stack assembly is secured by gently pulling the stack outward. The sieve stack for the Gilson GA6 Gilsonic Auto Siver Sonic Sifter is now ready for operation. For any questions concerning the Gilson GA6 Gilsonic Auto Siver Sonic Sifter or for any Gilson product, please contact the Gilson Technical Support Team.